the god of war often advocated for the giants. Although I don't recall if he ever declared allegiance outright. Okay, there's got to be some way to turn the wheel up here. Well there! Give a man some warning if he's about to suddenly end up snout deep in cheek. The ground. Was that an earthquake? Hmm. An occasional but not unheard of happenstance in Spartelfheim. With all the mining here, the land's bound to be a wee bit bothered. Oh wow, nice job getting it to lower exactly where we need it. I was thinking, because it's so warm, maybe it's not that the cold hasn't made it here yet, but maybe it's just different in Spartelfarm? Aye, lad. Fimble Winter doesn't strike all realms quite the same way. Weird that Fimble Winter doesn't always make it winter. In Midgard it does, but as you can see, the effects here appear far more gaseous in nature. Observe the geysers. Observe the aforementioned aroma. These effects were present before in some form, but now there's new extremity to them. Wow, 
father. Uh, up there. Hmm. I think we need to get that wheel moving, but the water doesn't reach. Imagine them siding with Odin. Well, all too often. <laughs> Brother, look! That strange bugger popped back out of the ground again. Way there. There's got to be another chain to lower the rest of the gate. Look, there's a chain we can pull up there. You can uncover that geyser from here. Hmm. 
what about freezing the guys around under the wheel? Maybe. <laughs> History, obviously. History. <laughs> Let's hope Tyr's in a talkative mood after being imprisoned for so long. Not all of Odin's captives can be as charmingly voluble as myself. We have no proof Tyr is truly here. Right. That earthquake earlier. You think there will be another one? It's unlikely. But geological disturbances tend to be unpredictable. If the geysers and smell here are worse because of Thimble Winter, maybe the earthquakes are too? Aye. You might be onto something, lad. Atreus, look ahead. Wow. Now this looks like a city. Welcome to Nidavellia, brothers. Hey, towards. Oh. They're uh running away. An alarm. I'd only sound an alarm like that if I still had my body and was fearing the notion of being detached from it. While that didn't expect you to disturb half the creepy crawlies in need of a lair. How was I supposed to know they were there? Behind you, brother! Behind you, brother! <laughs> Okay, so, Derlin. At your service. Sindri, any idea where the- occupation of this realm has its hooks in deep. But there aren't any guards patrolling. We're clearly not a threat. Why hide? Resist and you're made an example of, to keep the rest in line. Self-preservation can outweigh bravery for even the strongest of folk. Fear keeps them safe and alive. Tavern's gotta be around here somewhere. Maybe we can try knocking on some doors for directions. <clears throat> A firebomb from the chief anti-Odin propagandist in Durland's Rebellion. Quite a sharp wit she had until she turned to... There's a building just past these rocks behind me. Maybe we should head that way. Ah, those bloody mining rigs. What about them? The Skald is right to blame me for them. They were my idea. If you've got the time, they're in the bay just beyond this tunnel.
I'd particularly appreciate us checking out the mining rigs in the lake to the right. You can see the smokestacks from here. But if you don't want to explore now, it looks like Derlin's place is through that open gate to the left. So, which way do we go? We could prepare more before rescuing Tyr. Up to you. Hey, this isn't a farm. Not now. There are enemies ahead. Watch your right! Till I get up